Albertian Institute of Science and Technology make engineers not just engineering graduates. Hi, I'm Sangeet Joseph. I'm the final year student at Albertian Institute of Science and Technology. I'm from EC. So today I want to show you my final year project. So it was inspired by the Google Glass. As you all know, Google Glass is a smart glass. It uses augmented reality and it's also very costly. It's about 8,000 for the latest product. So we want to bring about this functionality to be accessible for students, techies and anyone who wanted to tinker with it. So that's how we built the augmented reality glasses. So this has the basic functionalities required to make any kind of product of augmented reality glasses. So let's say it has Bluetooth and Wi-Fi for connectivity, it has a camera module and also it can be used for lifetime language translation. That is what the basic functionality we have included right now. So this product can be available for a cost of about 10,000 rupees and that is actually a very accessible cost for most people uh, compared to the Google Glass which is about 80,000. So now so now let's take a look at what's inside these glasses. So first we have the transparent display on here. And the transparent display is connected to a driver into the brain of our glasses that is Raspberry Pi Zero. So this port is so small but it has enough power to process all the data that's coming in and going out. Also it has a Wi-Fi and Bluetooth connectivity. You can also connect some USB device to a mini micro USB port. So let's look at the camera module. So you can see a camera module that is connected with to the SPI interface. So now let's see how it works. Since I don't know Spanish, I have used Google Translate on my phone to see what is the translation in Spanish for how are you. Now let's give it to that. So let's take a look at the other side because you know when you look from the outside you will see a mirror image so you can't recognize it. So let's take a look. So that's how it's going to look when you see it from the inside. The language source that is Espanol that is Spanish and what is given input and the meaning of that. How are you? So, I know it looks a bit bulky, but yes, yeah, it's just a prototype. You'll see how it looks later. Thank you for seeing.